What's up guys, Joe here with another episode of our shop series. Today we are working on a 73 Ford truck that is in for a full repaint. As you can see, it's in pretty rough condition, but overall it's gonna come out great. We are going to go as close as the factory blue as we can, and then we're gonna paint the top black. Along with replacing most of the trim, we'll also repaint the wheels and do a spray in bed liner. This truck is gonna look killer. I'm going to start by tearing down the front end. It'll be a lot easier to get the trim off and prep all these parts for bodywork. Older vehicles tend to hold a lot of dirt and rocks behind the panels, and it's another reason why we like to tear down the front ends. It cleans up all this dirt before moving over to the paint side. I got the front end off, and Pops is going to start by sanding the old paint. We'll bring this one down to metal and work our way back up. From what we can tell, this is the factory finish and the truck has not been painted before, so that's a good sign. Just as we get started on a project, we need to rearrange for some more projects that get dropped off. We got another semi truck in for a full repaint along with some bodywork. Now after going over the game plan with Pops, I'll start on the semi while Pops is finished getting the Ford ready for bodywork. Pops is going to shave the front gas tank filler as the owner of the truck is going to have the interior redone and will be removing the inside fuel tank. After he's plugged, welded, and metal finished the area, then he'll move over and use a light coat of filler over top and then we'll sand and block that out smooth. I'm going to move the truck over into the booth for Pops so he can lay down some primer. And of course the truck doesn't start so I'll have to push it. Now the next process of the truck I didn't really film too much on as we primered, blocked, primered, and then blocked a few more times on this truck. It's hard to kind of see and tell what's going on through the lens. So we'll just fast forward through mixing some color and then the fun part, which is actually spraying the truck. We mix all of our colors in house. So after Pops found a color, we went up and mixed it. First, we'll start with the jams before spraying the body. We will be doing three coats of color and three coats of clear for this truck. Now, normally our first coat is a light coat, and then we follow with two heavier coats. The goal here is to lay a nice solid foundation so that when we add the clear coat to it, you'll have a little bit of depth in between the paint. All right guys, and that's looking pretty good. There's a few pieces of dirt that will sand out during the buffing process, but overall the truck looks pretty great. Alright guys, now just a few more final touches and the truck will be ready for pickup. Now I know this video may seem like it has been rushed because well, it was. Now I have been super busy with a lot of things going on at the shop and there's so much more that I want to show you guys. I just got to figure out the time to edit it all down. And so I'm going to be releasing a few shorter videos for the next two, three weeks. And then after that, hopefully I will get back into the longer set videos of explaining a little bit more of the process and stuff that we do. But if you guys like these style of videos and prefer that over the other ones, then let me know so I can save some time. But uh, anyway, thanks for watching and hope to see you guys on the next one.